We begin our team coverage tonight with KZI 9 News reporter Jillian Smuckler to show us what one professor is doing to get the message across to students about how they can help reduce the risk. Jillian. Renee, convincing college students to avoid going to parties, social distance, and wear a mask seems like an impossible task, especially because the reality is we've all been cooped up in our homes for seven months and many people are itching to get back to normal. But obviously that can't happen yet, especially here in Lane County since we're seeing a surge in COVID-19 cases. So how do you reach students and really show them the risk? Well, through social media, of course. Ellen Peters is the director of the Center for Science Communication Research at the University of Oregon. She's been using Twitter and statistics to show students the risks their behaviors have for themselves and others and to motivate them to practice good behavior. She says students have been extremely receptive and actually surprised to hear just how likely it is that they'll run into someone who is COVID positive. Based on current infections in Lane County, if you go to a party with 10 people, there's about a 4% chance that you're going to run into at least one COVID positive person at that party. If you go to a party with 100 people, though, that goes up to 37%. And that means you have nine times the risk if you go to that larger event compared to the smaller event. If you go to an event with just um, like two people, there's only a 1% chance. It's actually pretty small. She says students have been retweeting her and spreading the information for others to see, which is the goal. And she says she would never tell people to not socialize, but if you could do so safely, you would drastically improve the numbers we're reporting here in Lane County. And coming up on KEZI 9 News at 6, hear why she says shaming people for their activity choices actually ends up backfiring. Reporting live at the University of Oregon, Jillian Smuckler, KEZI 9 News.